for your love like crack from the beginning when I didn't know you quite like that. Knew we would hit it off. Now we somewhere get King, have you ever seen Sheamus more focused than he looks right now? No. He wants this win in the worst way. You can see it in his eyes. Not today. Too fast. Oh, wait. Nice reversal. Look at him unloading with the Dez Press. And wow, he hits it with the loot Dez Press. Quick thinking to avoid that. Oh, out of nowhere. And I'm looking at Sheamus. What's the story for him right now? A strategy a superstar will need against Sheamus is to not allow him to build momentum. Give an opponent. And there it is. The sharpshooter. Searing pain has to be going through that lower back. Well, luckily, the body hasn't absorbed too much of an attack up to this point. No, oh, wait. Nice reversal. Not today. Too fast. This could be big. A sickening thud as he lands hard. The crushing moves of the great white Sheamus have shown that if any WWE superstar is going to put their name on the dotted line, they better have a plan. Once Sheamus builds that momentum in a match, he starts thinking about that final attack, the bro kick. How much damage did that do? A lot from the looks of it. He whiffed that one. Looking good so far. Not much damage, if any, has been absorbed. Listen, we all know coming up with a strategy against Sheamus is easier said than done. But you need something if you're going to take on one of the strongest forces in WWE. If you get caught up in the momentum of Sheamus, he will eat you up. Wow, he just slammed him Two. with ease. Yeah, and almost slammed him right through the ring floor. Three. From our vantage point, it doesn't even look like a Four. sweat has been broken. And he brings the action back inside the ring. Yeah, I, I, I think this is good strategy. One. And there's the face buster. Don't look in the mirror after that one. Hey, I heard when you look in the Two. mirror, your reflection throws up. Uh. Three. Sheamus is one of my favorite WWE success stories. If you look closely, you can find him as a part of security detail on WWE television segments during Four. its European shows. He then relocated to the United States and trained in WWE's developmental system before blasting his way onto the WWE's main roster. We're looking at complete domination here. We know what's coming. Oh, she blows the RKO. Who do you think you are, Captain Ahab? Another electric crowd on hand here for SmackDown, as has been the norm over the years. It's got to be hard to rebound from that one. Check that out. That's how effective offense can be when you're able to combine moves together. And somebody's going to be sore in the morning. I'm not sure Two. I can watch this. Three. Oh, man, I wouldn't mind a wireless mic right now. Four. We don't want to be here much longer. This might be it. Whoa, that's 
gonna leave a mark. Six. I like it. Seven. Let's get this thing done inside the ring. One. And Sheamus reverses it. Sheamus has blood flowing. Three. You have to wonder how much use of that arm he'll have as this match continues. Well, we're on the move here. Five. Six. Inside the ring again. Yeah, and Seven. they should be. This is where the action needs to be. Moves like that can upset your opponent more than hurt them. Crash into the canvas like that can tear muscles and break bones. No kidding, this may be close to being over. Well, out here you have to be able to think on your feet lightning fast. One mistake, one moment of hesitation, and you can find yourself in a world of hurt. Six. Seven. Bringing it back between the ropes. And that's a good thing. Eight. One. He's still not through. Well, we're on the Two. move here. Three. Hey, now. Oh, once you get out of the ring, Four. anything can happen. You've got exposed steel, concrete, the barricades, and all Five. of it can be used to cause massive damage. A brutal attack. I'm telling you, if you didn't suffer from internal Eight. injuries before, you are now. I can guarantee it. Nine. One. Oh, wow. Well, out here, you have to be able to think on your feet lightning fast. Two. One mistake, one moment of hesitation, and you can find yourself in a world of hurt. When he gets going like this, there are few better. Back in the ring, and the official's got his back to the action again. Oh, this has got to end. Look at him unloading with the Daz Press. This is a wreck. He's moving like an uncaged animal. Oh, why? He's wild in there. I'm not sure I can watch. That's it. He's out. Six. Seven. Remember, momentum in WWE can Eight. turn on a dime. And look at this change. Now, that is just dangerous. No kidding. Nine. Ten. Okay, ring the bell. The ref calls the match off. I don't blame him. This thing was way out of hand from the get-go. Please welcome my guest tonight. Let's talk about Seth Rollins. How do you feel about him as you will face him at the pay-per-view? Does he not know that I am a monster? My thoughts on him is he's dumb. He's dumb to step into the ring with me. He has no clue how much pain I am going to put him through. He has not seen anyone like me before. I'm a beast. Thanks for the time. Back to you.